Modern policing relies on a digital database, even though the modern police database got its start well before computers. Alphonse Bertillon is considered to be its father, founding the Department of Judicial Identity in Paris in 1893. His revolutionary information organization and collection methods, including the standardization of mugshots, soon spread throughout the Western world, even earning him a nod from Sherlock Holmes in The Hounds of Baskerville. The evolution from then until now has been a challenge. The West Midlands Police Force is one of the largest in the UK, and they serve a population of 2.8 million people, which generates a lot of data on a daily basis, as Director of Technology Helen Davis explains. In terms of calls for service, we have thousands of, of 999 calls every day. They've also got investigations ongoing and, you know, patrols and everything else um, in the mix as well. So a very, very busy police force. We have millions, literally millions of, of pieces of data recorded every month. Of course, they've long had digitized systems to manage this massive volume of data. Still, just because their database was digital doesn't mean it was up to the task of serving one of the most diverse populations in all of Europe. IT hadn't been invested in greatly for um, a significant number of years, sort of 10 years plus. We kept the lights on, but we kept using the legacy systems in the legacy way. And by that, I mean systems that, that are in silos and they don't talk to each other, they're not interoperable. So all those data points were being captured multiple times in multiple systems. This inefficiency meant that officers were spending too much time relaying and entering information or waiting for the information they needed to do their jobs. Something needed to change. So we had this huge aspiration that we would move to the cloud, which in UK policing was unheard of. We wanted to have this single source of truth, and then we sat back and thought, that's a great aspiration. We actually don't know how to get there. West Midlands Police Force turned to Cloudera for their capabilities and expertise. Cloudera helped us map out what needed to happen and then very much held our hand through each step. We now have one data set. With our data-driven insights platform, it means that information can now easily be populated in all our systems. So you put it in once and then you can see it wherever it needs to be. It really is the heart of the organization with everything else coming in and out of it. So we retain that data lake, which is pure um, as a single source of truth for all our data. So what does it mean to have a police force that has all of the information they need right at their fingertips? So if they can do things quicker and they can do things for themselves, they're spending more time fighting crime. So if they're not waiting for 45 minutes to get some information, they've got it on their phone within literally seconds, they can move on to the next investigation or the next call for service, so they're more readily available to the public. It really is true transformation. And we say that a lot, we use that, that phrase a lot, right? oh, it's transformational. Well, mm, kind of, but this really is, it really has changed how the force does business. So I am, I am passionate about this one, I really am. By making data accessible and unified, West Midlands Police Force is better serving their community in ways that allow them to be proactive instead of reactive. That's how data keeps public service moving.